what do you think our purpose on this planet is? <sighs> do we have a purpose? Or are we just like all, you know, trying I, to organize chaos? Is that like I what I think life it could is? be a little bit of both of those things. I think also purposes, I think, might change throughout times as you go through like your – these different life cycles. You know, mm-hmm. whether it's like, you know, I think we go through different cycles, whether it's a like – I feel like I went through a six-year life cycle recently, mm. and it tapered off. So now I'm, like, re-entering another life cycle of mine. It's, mm-hmm. like, different long chapters or something. Yeah. Um, and I think, like, each of those, the purpose changed, you know? So I think right now I'm trying to figure out what's my new purpose. Where am I going to go? Because, like, I expanded all this amount. Yeah. Cleared out all this stuff, this baggage. So now I'm, like, starting fresh and new. Now where do I go? Yeah. So I think my purpose changed. But do you know what I mean, though? I'm Because I'm thinking about it on a more general level. Like, is our purpose to be happy? Is our purpose to bring joy to other people? Is our purpose to, like, change the lives of those of those of us, those around us? Is our, like, oh. like why are we here? <laughs> why are you and I even to here? TikTok. Why are we here? <laughs> Just kidding. There you go. That's what it is. <laughs> Just admit lipstick on TikTok. I don't know. Um, I guess on a general way, I think, like, I don't know if it's just general one purpose. Like, I think you could, you know, live life um, to be happy. Um, I think, like, let me reorganize my thoughts on that because what am I trying to say? It's a weird question, right? Because, yeah, it, like, what well, from it, what perspective, too? Like, yeah, from the perspective planet's to, perspective? I could look at it as a way of, you know, my, my, my purpose as a, like, singularity of my own and, and taking it out of out of the world but like maybe my purpose is just you know going through this life and, and figuring you know different things out mm-hmm. for me as a human being um and what that happiness could be mm-hmm. and i think that does definitely changes um i kind don't of like know life is like a puzzle and you have to like put it together yeah we're putting it together throughout the whole time I, that's why i'm having a heart like i can't just think of one purpose yeah my, my life has had yeah you know, I think, you know, when you go through a bunch of different things, I think that those purposes change. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if it's just to be happy either. Yeah. That seems kind of too arbitrary. Although that's also something really, really great to achieve. Right. Because if you're happy, then that usually means that you're bringing happiness to other people. Mm-hmm. So then it, is it to affect the lives around you in a positive way. And and then in that sense, that could be different for everybody. For an artist, it could be to create great art. For, you know, a mother or father, it could be to raise, you know, children who feel loved. For a scientist, it could be to cure cancer. Yeah. And I think the more aligned you are with whatever that is for you, yeah. I think that's lifting your vibration and that's what's vibrating out and attracting whatever into your yeah. life. And, you know, they say that the key to happiness, um, because, you know, that's the one thing that I think everyone's searching for, right? We're all, like, literally all we want is to be happy. Now, the way that we go about it is different for everybody (laughs) and often misdirected. Um, But the one that really resonated with me was, uh, I forget his name, but he said that generally human beings are happiest when they feel they have a purpose. Like, we're like, you know. We, we, we are, we are human be we're human beings that are doing, even though they say, don't be a human doing, be a human being. But do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, th- guess, like we want to feel like we're contributing to. But is that coming something. from an ego? Cause are we like, is our ego just saying that we have to contribute to something to be important? Yeah, I don't know. You know? I mean, we should like be contributing something somehow, right? Even if, again, it's yeah. just bringing happiness and joy to, like, your friends and people around you. Yeah, I, I think like, you shouldn't be, like, sucking, no, like, the I life out so. of the world. <laughs> Hopefully not. Hopefully not. We're being <laughs> vampires to one another. That'd be horrible. But I also feel like if you're on, like if you're just – if you're getting more aligned and you're radiating that, you're going to bring happiness to other people. Yeah. You know, if you're controlling and you are going to be that vampire, you've chosen that side to do mm-hmm. that. And so you're going to, you know, limit yourself that way. Yeah. Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening to bonus Q and A's, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoes shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.